Boom! Trump tweets treason after latest New York Times anonymous hit piece by Jim Hoft for the GatewayPundit.com. New York Times saboteur inside White House Drudge Report. On Wednesday, the New York Times published an op-ed from an anonymous senior Trump administration official bragging about being a saboteur inside the White House. The New York Times prefaced the op-ed by saying they are taking a rare step of publishing an anonymous op-ed essay and labeled the author as a senior official in the Trump administration. In opinion, the New York Times today is taking the rare step of publishing an anonymous op-ed essay. We have done so at the request of the author, a senior official in the Trump administration whose identity is known to us and whose job would be jeopardized by its disclosure. We believe publishing this essay anonymously is the only way to deliver an important perspective to our readers. The author claimed people within the Trump administration are working diligently from within to frustrate parts of Trump's agenda. The Anon official trashed President Trump's leadership style suggested he was mentally unstable and praised John McCain. The New York Times got savage for this anonymous hit piece. President Trump just tweeted out, Treason? Trump earlier slammed the failing New York Times for its gutless editorial, the failing New York Times. It will be in about six and a half years from now. <laughs> the New York Times and CNN and all of these phony media outlets will be out of business, folks. They'll be out of business yep. because there'll be nothing to write and there'll be nothing of interest. So nobody has done what this administration has done. And I agree, it's different from an agenda, which is much different than ours, and it's certainly not your agenda, that I can tell you. It's about open borders. It's about letting people flee into our country. It's about a disaster and crime for our country. So they don't like Donald Trump, and I don't like them because they're very dishonest people. Remember this also about the New York Times. When I won, they were forced to apologize to their subscribers. They wrote a letter of apology. It was the first time anybody's ever done it because they covered the election incorrectly. So if the failing New York Times has an anonymous editorial, can you believe it? Anonymous, meaning gutless, a gutless editorial. Uh, we're doing a great job. The poll numbers are through the roof. Our poll numbers are great. And guess what? Nobody is going to come close to beating me in 2020 because of what we've done. We've done more than anybody ever thought possible in, it's not even two years. So thank you very much. <laughs> Absolutely. It is a gutless editorial. Yeah. Anonymous source. Yeah, they usually quoted anonymous sources. Absolutely. Yeah. And they expect to be, yeah, they will be out of business. Let me know what you uh, guys think in the comments below. And again, thank you so much for watching.